something literally just touched my hat. Did you just touch me? Colin. Colin, get up. Colin. My friend and I spent the night at this haunted castle. We didn't get much sleep, but we did spend the entire night investigating and we caught some insane paranormal activity. This castle is said to be haunted by a lady in a black dress who once lived here. She has been caught in multiple photos in mirrors and can be seen by one of the windows. Something heavily affected my friend's energy and he fell asleep on one of the couches. But with this particular couch, a man actually passed away on. When the owners left us, they locked the door behind them. We were told that not many people can spend the entire night here in this castle alone. This is Wilson Castle. Hi, I'm Denise. The castle is my family home. It's been in my family for 80 years. Why don't you tell us about your craziest paranormal experience here in the castle? Um, it was after my mom passed away and my brother was pushing me to sell the castle. And I did not want to do it because I love it. I was being pulled. So I asked her for some guidance and then the dinner bells downstairs rang twice. But, and that cannot happen unless you have the, the stick to play them. And then right after that, the music box went off. I felt very emotional and happy because I, I knew she was telling me to do what my heart was telling me. And she gave you confirmation. That's really yeah. awesome. Yeah. And let me ask you, are these pictures related to you in any way? Is that dress related to your family in any way? That dress is my grandmother's dress. This firm is my grandmother's. And that's the, um, the dress that has been seen in photos, right? Yes. And we have a photograph of her that a man took. And then he sent it to us because that lady wasn't there. It was him and his little boy. And we have the photograph in that room of a woman standing looking out. She's in the turret and she's looking out the window. And then there's another picture of her over here that she's standing in this doorway and it's the same woman and she has the black dress on. And who do you think that is? I, I don't, I can't tell because it's somebody younger. And this was your grandmother's dress? Yeah. So spirits like to be seen sometimes in their most youthful form. They like to be seen the way that they remember best or had the happiest memories. Right. So it, it definitely could still be your grandmother. It's just interesting because that was her dress. Yeah, and it, it, it's the dress. What's up guys, Chris Starr here and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm at the famous Wilson Castle in Vermont. You may have seen Oh My Gosh TV was here. He's actually the one that recommended this place to me. So huge shout out to one of my great friends, Omar. But I'm also here with one of my great friends, Colin from the Paranormal Files to so make sure you guys are checking him out as well. So we are in the most haunted room in the entire castle. This place is stunning, like it's actually breathtaking. But right behind us in that closet, which you guys probably can't see, is the, <laughs> whew, is the famous dress of the lady who haunts this place. There are photos of her that have been captured in that dress in this room. Mm -hmm. So who knows what we're gonna get ourselves into tonight, right? It's very creepy in here. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, it is eerie. Yeah, it definitely has that extra spooky vibe to it tonight. So we are completely lights out and we're about to uh, just get going, see what we can find. I'm ready, dude. Let's get it. Let's do it. So I will say we are already pretty pretty creeped out because we spent the night at the Conjuring House. It's already 2 a.m. We're running on no sleep, so I'm yeah. excited to just see where this night takes us. But again, guys, this place is absolutely stunning and I have a lot of details to share with you. We just put the REM pod down and it started going off like almost instantly. 
Yeah, I wasn't filming, but the moment I turned the ramp on, this thing started. Oh my gosh. <laughs> then right when we started filming, it stopped hitting. I know. And it's right next to this dress. The this lady in the, the black uh, dress. This is the, as the person described to us, the haunted dress, the kind of trigger object here that people have taken photos of a woman wearing. Which I don't exactly like to hear, but here, um, let me turn the obvious on. Can the lady in the black dress communicate with us tonight? Object. <gasps> Trigger object. Oh. What? On object. Dang, it's Are hanging. you kidding? On object. What? Look at that. That's exactly what it just fucking said. Object hung. No, it said hung first. Hung object. Because the Whoa. bottom is hung. I was just talking this about that. This is the dress. Yo, this was crazy. her dress. Look at this hanging right there. Wow, I can't believe that's, that's our first crazy, response. Dude. I got chills, literally. In front of her. That's a good idea. If you're here with us in this room, can you make the black device in front of your dress light up? If we're communicating with the lady in the black dress, can you please make that light up any color? Okay, my name is Colin. I'm here with my friend Chris. If there's anybody in this mansion or home, we are inviting you to come out and speak with us tonight. Come through, talk to us, give us any sort of a sign that you're here. We are not afraid of you. We just want to, you know, communicate with you. So if you're a woman, you're a man, Come through and talk to us. We're inviting you in. We saw that you had that light up for us before. Can you use your energy to do that for us again? We're hearing things. Hold on. Wait. Is that you? If that's you, can you knock for us? Can you just make any single sign of your presence in any way you'd like? Someone like almost running. Mm -hmm. You hear that? Mm -hmm. Like a thud, 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 thud. Come here. Come here. Just listen. If you're here, come out with us. Can you use any of the devices in front of us to communicate? You could just light that up for us. Just let us know that you're here. We'd just really like to talk to you. Do you not feel hot? No. I feel hot as shit. It's not hot in here. It's actually pretty chilly. I'm like dead ass. It's like pretty really cold in here. It's actually like 50 degrees out tonight. And there's not much insulation in here. And it's all cement. This is just all cement. Inner. What is that? Inner, wait. Inner. It's inside. Yeah, it's in here. She's in here. She's in here. Yeah, just that inner. Yeah, and we're hearing in. sounds, yeah. Okay, we're coming into... Let me know if you see anything, guys. Yeah, that 
dress is creepy as shit. I don't like that. I don't like that. <laughs> Yeah, so apparently this was her morning gown. So we're sitting inside of the closet where the dress is, and I heard a faint woman's voice. If I do catch it, if we do, if we did catch it, it'll be on Colin's camera because he was recording it in Fred. So and then he thinks he heard a whistle. I didn't hear the whistle, but I did hear he asked if. Or no, he didn't ask. What did you say? You said I, I heard something out there, mm -hmm. and it sounded like a a woman say yeah. Audible, faint but audible. Do you want to walk out to the main area? <laughs> can you make that stop? Can you can you walk away from the device for us, please? Whoa. This will not stop going off. Holy shit. Can you step away from the device for us? Hello? You in the Wilson Castle? I've never seen it operate like that. I don't really know what to do. What? Sorry guys, I just like change locations just to make sure that there's no wiring under there that would let off any sort of mm -hmm. like EMF. And I put it back in the same spot so that kind of debunks what I was thinking. Like maybe there were some wires running underneath. Mm -hmm. So just gonna say this real quick. A lot of times when we do use EMF devices, so pretty much a REM pod just detects EMF and it allows the spirit to connect with us using different light sources. But a lot of times when we use these EMF devices, people complain because we're inside, but just to show you if this was any sort of wiring or anything that was giving off EMF, it would still be going off. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I'm so I'm freezing. You could even feel my freaking hands. Like, feel my hands. I'm so cold. You okay? Sure. It's so hot. Overheating. So I guess now is the time to talk about the couch. The only known death in this home was on this couch right in front of us. The man had a heart attack, so I'm wondering if we should just take a seat. We're gonna sit on your couch here. Is the spirit of the man here with us? Let's just try out the Spirit Box app that I use. So this is the Necrophonic app and it is available for iPhone and Android and I use it in almost every single one of my videos. It eliminates white noise. Uh, links for that will be down below if you guys are interested in checking it out. Uh, but let's just give this, let's give this a go and just see if we can communicate with anyone. Uh, we were, it did seem like we got some responses in the room with the lady in the black dress. It's so funny because it's usually the lady in the white dress, you mm -hmm. know? It's Always. The lady in the Always. black dress, so it's a little ironic. Let's just see, maybe we can communicate with the spirit of the man. Is, is the spirit of the man here with us? Did you die on this couch? Yes. What? You're over there. Walk on over. You can use the device in the doorway or you can speak directly into our cameras or communicate with the device in my hand. Was that you walking? I 
feel colder right here. I was just talking about how I feel hot, but I feel... What the fuck? It's Harvard Harvest. Oh my god, dude, I'm gonna cry. What was that? I got chills on my whole body. What was that? Oh my god, dude, look at, film my arm for a second. Look at my goosebumps. Who's here with us? Can you do that again for us? We'll sit here in silence for Oh my free. god, I'm so cold. Do you feel that? Oh my it's god, look what at, the Look at my arm. <gasps> look at my God, I, I literally have goosebumps. Bro, you cannot fake this. It came from that, that like, room. Dude, you know what that sounded like? It sounded like the hanger. No, it sounded like metal on metal. Like. <sighs> Thank you for communicating with us. We really do appreciate that. We love your castle. You know who Joe Exotic is? This guy right here. <laughs> <laughs> I feel much colder all of a sudden. Yeah. Like substantially colder. Here, I have an idea. How about you sit right here? I'll go sit on this couch. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'll sit. Well, unfortunately, closer to the creepy room. Okay. We're just gonna kind of wait here in silence at this point. Just see, because unfort unfortunately. The spirit box was going when we caught that disembodied voice, which is so crazy. Anybody here in the Wilson Castle? Oh. Just heard that. Just heard that. What did it say? I don't know. There's a room you don't want us to stay in tonight. Can you shut the door? We're literally just laying here, just waiting to hear more voices because there's voices coming from the lady in the black dress's room. Colin's like, I hear footsteps. Colin, you hear that? Mm -hmm. Something just touched my hat, dude. Something literally just touched my hat. Colin. Did you just touch me? Was that you? Wow. Can you just give us one sign, maybe knock like this? Colin, mm -hmm. I think we should go in that room. This one? Yes. Okay. I think we should go back into the room. This is where, right? You would agree this is where we're hearing the, the Some whispers. I'm, you thought it was a voice. I thought it was a hanger room. But then we heard another one. I know, but I, I, I just think it was the hanger shifting. Could try and see if anything in here moved. Is that you? Would that be it's so cold back here like this? No, it wouldn't be. That wouldn't be the hanger. There's all these white lamps all over my freaking Polaroid. Look at that. Mm. Orbs on the Polaroid. Yeah. Oh, that's crazy. On her dress. Yeah. All right, we'll be back. If you can make this light up for us while we're downstairs. Oh, I didn't do shit. Sorry, guys. I, I accidentally pocket. turned my camera of off. I turned my camera off because Colin dropped that. Wait, did we even check out this room? What is that room? It's beautiful. Me too. I gotta pee. Is that why you want to go downstairs? No, I just I actually have a feeling that we should go down here. Wow. This is so spooky. Yeah, this is... I'm not going to lie to people online. I was saying this to Chris all night. This shit seems like Scooby-Doo. You know what I mean? We have a very Scooby energy. We have Shandy in the mix. Who are you? Daphne? I'm Daphne. Um, 
So when the flight is in front of when this. Why is that so offensive? <laughs> You're so triggered by that. I'm a nerd. I'm a nerd. I'm a nerd. I'm a nerd. Your husband <laughs> called me a nerd all day. Truth. Um, so I just really want to point out when you are investigating in a haunted dark place and you have your big light on top, you can't see anything in front of you. So it does really add to the spook factor. You're going to go pay? I'm spooked. Oh, well, you made a friend. Hey, come on, buddy. Oh, I got the chills. Oh, he actually landed on me. Did you get that on camera? Hi, man. Is it the lady in the black dress? So let's just take a peek around, guys. We are on the first floor. And the first floor is pretty spectacular, I will say. Wow. Look at this. What is that thing? I don't know. What is that? Does anyone know what that is? Just like a cabinet of sorts? Holy shit. The priceless gems of Wilson Castle. Just imagine for one second just being this regal, this royal. Can you imagine? Imagine you live in this house. So imagine, I know I said that like a thousand times, but this was your home hundreds of years ago. And you had the opportunity to live in something this beautiful. This room right in front of me is probably my favorite room in the entire castle. There is artwork in here that is original. I'm gonna see if you guys can guess which one it is. No, it's not Colin. <laughs> Stop it off the earring. Wow, these are paintings of the castle. Is anybody here on the bottom floor of the Wilson Castle? Do you remember? My light just died. No way. Just now? Just now. Can you hold this? Yeah, that was on camera too. Physical? Like Battery move pack. something? Knock on something? Touch me? Can you speak to us again? I'd like to hear your voice. It's beautiful artwork up there that, that you had done. Yes, guys, this is the original artwork here. Everything else that you're seeing was bought, I'm assuming by the current owners, but I'm not too sure where any of this really does come from. I just know that these are real authentic works of art, but the ceiling was hand painted and created back when the castle was in creation. Mm -hmm. Colin! God, you scared me. It's like it's calling us to go to different places. At least me. Yeah. Well, that's what'll happen, kind of to divert our attention away. Maybe it just doesn't, you know, it's either it doesn't want to hang out with us or maybe it's just trying to play some games mm -hmm. him or her whoever it is you know what i'm feeling what are you feeling alone i think you and i need to do sessions alone okay you're gonna go in the room with the black dress you want me to i don't know what do you want to do i was gonna ask you what you want to do i don't care what do you want to do i mean i'll go up there maybe the energy is more willing to interact with one crazy person and not two. I'm like wondering, should I like sit here? That's a good idea actually. Because I could see yeah. like upstairs and downstairs. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, I'll go sit up in the creepy ass ladies room. And she knows that all day I've been telling her that I'm freaked out by this shit. <laughs> you know that too. I've been saying that all day. If there's anybody up there. Come follow me into this room. I'm an easy victim, easy party, you can scare me. So Colin and I split up and he's in the ladies room. So I can see the downstairs and the upstairs, except I can't see anything right now. But I heard a voice. Let me know if you guys heard that and I heard him walking. Chris? What? I'm gonna kill my light up here. Okay. So if you hear me scream, you gotta come up right away. 
Why? Okay. What? Yes, I'll help you. It's so beautiful here, guys. If there's anyone here with me, you can speak into my camera. We're just sitting in different areas right now. I'm sitting on the couch where the man died. We've been in the yard all night, but I'm so tired all of a sudden. We're gonna communicate using that spirit box that we were using before when you were speaking to us. Where did you go? Go away, <laughs> Chris. Is there anything you'd like to say to me? I heard you say my name. Did something make us tired? Was it the man that passed away here on the couch? I feel dead. I was just sitting in there. What the? I can barely keep my eyes open, and that's weird to me. Do you want to wrap? I'm, I kind of have to. I mean, we can sit here. I'm just going to... No, we I We think... should do a little more spirit boxing. I literally... I just I want to be careful, especially after what happened to you last night. Because your energy is already pretty low. I just, you know? I can't stop yawning. Yeah, I know. It is 3 a.m. I know, but still. No, I like, know, I'm just saying, like, it is the witching hour. I've, like, I was fine going in there, and now I'm like, Who made him tired? Was that the man? Mm -hmm. I'm freezing, like, I'm so cold. I'm like, this is an unnatural level of tired. Do you want to walk around for a sec? You're not falling asleep here. I'm not going to fall asleep. I get it, but I'm like concerned about you because of what happened last night. I just, I don't want to leave you. Oh, okay. Do you think maybe we should just wrap it up? Mm. 
just give it five more minutes. I'll stay awake. I'm just literally in the last ten minutes I've become so tired. Guys, I think that whatever passed mm. through this area, I was pretty far from Colin. Like I'm only in the other room where I was on the couch. And I think whatever was here, this bug just keeps flying on me. Whatever was here passed like over by me and now it's like heavily affecting him. Like I was just a little tired. So I just closed my eyes for a few seconds. I shut my camera off because my battery died, but it's happening to Colin right now. Like he can't even keep his eyes open. Are you sure you're okay? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Guys, I'm just a little concerned because of what happened last night at the conjuring house happened around the same time that it's happening right now. So I'm just a little I'm still listening to worried. Movies. Okay. Colin, I think you should get up. Colin. 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 Colin, get up. Colin. Oh my god. Colin. Colin. Dude. Colin. Get up, dude. You're literally sleeping. We'll wrap up. I don't I just don't want you sleeping out here and also you're concerning me. Oh my god. Get up. Let's just get up for now. I just don't want anything to deplete your energy. I don't I don't want anything to be affecting you, especially after last night. Like we cannot allow that to happen. So why don't we just regroup for a second? Why don't we go downstairs and then we'll get ready for bed. Like the moment I laid on this couch, I got so tired. Yeah, let's go downstairs and just like regroup. What's happening? Holy shit, I'm so tired. That's I'm really bizarre. So quickly. Yeah, let's regroup. Just for a sec. I'm done. I'm done. All right, we're done. Hey guys, so I actually didn't do an outro for this video because we were so unbelievably tired by the end of the night and we had to rush off to our next location in the morning. So I just wanted to just let you guys know that we made it through the night okay. I did wake up around probably 5.30, about 10 minutes after finally falling asleep to something crashing and falling. And unfortunately, we weren't recording through the night, but if you guys wanna see us go back there, drop some comments comments and maybe we'll go back there and do another overnight but this time film ourselves sleeping. Colin is fine but I do think that something totally drained his energy. I have never seen him like that and the fact that he was kind of scared at one point was just really confusing to me because he's never like that. Um, yeah, he gets startled sometimes, but he's never scared to go places by himself So the lady in the black dress definitely made him super super uncomfortable And I don't blame him before I go though guys make sure you guys are Smashing that like button and make sure that you guys are subscribed to my channel because I checked and yes You you are not subscribed to my channel only 50% of the people that watch my videos are subscribed So all you gotta do is hit that little subscribe button and tap that little bell to be notified every single time I drop a video. There are a few ways that you guys can support me. I do have some merch, brand new merch in fact, some new face masks which are super cool. One thing that I do just want to say is a huge freaking thank you to everybody that has contributed to my GoFundMe. Many of you guys know I am going through this like insane jaw recovery, trying to get my jaw fixed for my severe TMJ. It has not been a good time and it is super expensive. So thank you to everybody who has reached out offered prayers and support and kind words and for your monetary contributions on GoFundMe. The link for that will be down below and if you guys are interested in reading my story and checking out some updates, all of that is on the GoFundMe page as well. So thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. You have no idea how much you are helping me. If it wasn't for you, I would not be able to get these jaw treatments. That's going to do it for this video. I will catch you guys super soon. Peace out, starlings.